Okay, so we go here, and now we want to test uh, test list in uh, keyword, I guess, right? So let's create a list, and I'll create one from the book, right? They, they're using different values. Let me. Uh, copy okay so we're using maybe product numbers and then we can do a search right we can say uh, self.assert equal def there assert equal and then we can say uh, true because we're going to say is v uh, 475 in prod nums it is right here so this statement should be true let's go ahead and run it I this is good like if you create like a data entry program and someone wants to create a new a new product then you check if the product exists already right and if it exists then you ask them if they want to modify it or update it or if they want to delete something from the from the list right then you look for it and then you ask them are you sure you want to delete this item okay so uh, did i run it i don't remember <laughs> let's run it okay so we go here uh okay we're good uh test list and keyword test list and keyword that's right here we are okay let's do a negative test right so we'll do lowercase v that should generate a false and we can go back and run this run and we're still okay right so that's the in and there's also not in right so we can do a different test case for that one not in and we create an assertion equal and then we say uh true it's kind of like the opposite, right? So we say 475 not in prot nums. So it's not in here, so it should generate true. Okay, not in right here. It generates uh, the correct uh, Boolean value, right? True. And then we can also do uh, the opposite right so I'll copy and paste capitalize this and now it's false right so v475 is not in prods it's right here so it is in so then it should generate false because it is there is kind of confusing right so we go here and run it and test list not in keyword And that's how we can use uh, in and not in to check for values uh, in the current list. Questions here? <clears throat> so if you were creating your program, then you use if statements, right? Like if uh, v475 not in Prodnums do something else to something else, right? Okay, questions again? One more time here. I mean, this is kind of like this, it's the same thing that we did for strings, right? But now working with list elements.
Okay, uh, let me see here. 